Hello, Osef Financial Experts. My deep greetings. This is Ayman Ayman Muhammad again, and today we are going to continue our discussion for SAP Financial Document Splitting Tips and Tricks or Advanced Configuration for Document Splitting. Today we are going to, to talk about how to configure or add additional zero balance document splitting clearing accounts. In the last session, we talked about if I have two different profit centers and each profit center representing a branch and I need to generate inter-branch clearing account between them but the business case this time that what if I have profit centers in one zone or area and I have different profit centers in, the, in another zone or area or segment and there is inter-branch clearing account between them or interaction between them. In this case, they are not in the same zone to say that it's inter-branch clearing account. However, I can say it's inter-zone clearing account. In this case, I can generate different zero balance or there is a requirement to generate different zero balance clearing account. There is another case that can be used that if I have a statistical posting or offer balance sheet posting. In this case, I shall not use same zero balance clearing account, but generate zero balance clearing account different than the standard one, which is also out of balance sheet. That the business cases that I faced is that required different zero balance clearing account. In today's session, I'll start the demo now in front of you to show how to the business process for how to generate totally different zero balance clearing account with small modification in one document uh, during the document processing. Let's start. I already entered. I already entered here. One document, debit line item, credit line item, and for first line item, as you can see, I'll press more to get the profit center YB six hundred, and for the second line item, there is totally different profit center. Let's press more again to get the profit center. It's YB one hundred ten. In this case, it's two different branches, two different profit centers. Let's go to simulate in general ledger and see zero balance clearing account and how it's a zero wise pair profit center let's go to profit center sort and i can find pay profit center debit and credit generated let's have subtotal okay there is no total let's do total in amount first and then go to subtotal as pair profit center level you can see that each profit center is uh, zero wise this means debit and credit are equal I return back and I change the document type from SA to A document type I create one one digit document type I go for simulating general ledger again let's simulate and I'll find totally different zero balance clearing account I call it allocation or whatever and I'll do subtotal again because profit center let's to totalize make subtotal per profit center make sure it's zero wise per profit center with totally different zero balance clearing account as you can see it started with line zero let me save this layout to make and make a default triple layout line save and let's return back one time again to document type SA instead of A this is zero balance branch one let's go to SA And here I go to simulate in general ledger again. Press enter. I can find the zero balance clearing account is 295 start with 295, which is totally different and representing, for example, inter branches. I go to configuration, financial accounting, general ledger accounting, business transaction, documents playing, zero balance clearing account. To see the key account key that I create, account key triple zeros, which is standard one. 
for my charted account I can write through OPY6 and here you can find 2950 balance given in the account however if I go to Z000 I'll find nine zeros clearing account. This is for bar one. Thank you for watching. See you later.